My name is Adrian Sandoval and I am a welder here at GNB. So basically an orbital welder is something that's able to be placed around a certain tube or just anything that has a round circumference and it goes around and welds it on its own without you having to do anything. You just basically are just looking at it and running a whole program. An orbital welder would basically just be around like uh, anything that has a, a round circumference. So like if you can go a whole round, that's what basically that you could do with this head right here. Each head has a different size, so you can just basically put a bigger tube or a smaller tube on it. So the process that we're doing today on orbital welding would be TIG welding. And then we're gonna be using 100% pure argon. The way I have everything set up is that you have two set of clamps you're able to open one up and uh, basically uh, set in your part. This could come out and then you could basically butt it up to the part that you have in here. And then you, you line it up to where the tungsten's at and then that tungsten will go around the whole thing and then weld it. Today I'm gonna to be demonstrating how the orbital welding works. We're gonna be butting up two tubes together and then we're gonna end up uh, basically plugging it up to where the gas is inside, making sure that it has full penetration all the way around. The welding parameters, the way they work is you, you grab a piece of test tube, you place it inside the orbital welding head, and then you, you kind of just play around with it. So first, we're gonna end up turning our purge line on to make sure that the, uh, the gas starts to fill up inside, and then we're gonna plug it up. And then once it's plugged up, we're gonna close this little thing right here, we're gonna head over to the machine. And then from there, we're gonna end up taking it off test mode just to make sure that nothing happens while you're putting and placing all these stuff in. And then uh, I'm gonna end up starting it right now. It's gonna end up pushing a whole bunch of gas inside to make sure that the part is fully endoused in like all the gas that it needs. And then it's gonna start tacking around. It, it places eight tacks in different, in different spots. And then once it gets done with the eighth tack, it'll go back and then it'll start to weld. So right now it's going to start welding and at the beginning it'll have a travel delay and then it'll just start making that bead and then once that bead starts to form it'll start going around and then fully penetrating all the way around and you're basically monitoring this whole thing off of the screen on the computer. So the part ended up finishing and then you just take off this plug. It's gonna be hot, so you just gotta be careful. Take this piece off. And then you're gonna take this one in the back off. Take off your purge line. Make sure you turn it off so that you're not wasting any gas. And then this is the completed part. And then basically we check on the inside to make sure that there's full penetration all the way around. And uh, we don't get any leaks. For your, all your orbital welding needs, contact GMB first.